Hey Chris Gibson fan, I hope you guys are well. Thank you for joining me on the channel. We're going to be talking today about a specific exercise that takes like four minutes that will actually lift and tighten the jawline and the neck area. Now this is part of a series of videos that I did last year on facial yoga, but I keep finding that this particular exercise has worked so well for so many of you. Just check out the comments on that video. I'll link to it below in the video description box. I have all of these facial yoga exercises, including this one. But this one exercise comes up over and over again on how to do it correctly because it is a little tricky when you first start learning how to do it. So I wanted to do a dedicated video on how to lift the neck, tighten the double chin, and tighten the jawline. One simple exercise, so let's get started. Now, as with any exercise you start, you wanna start easy and you wanna go slow. You don't wanna do a bunch of repetitions the very first day because you're gonna end up having some soreness and then you'll give up and not come back and do them. And they really, really do work very well. Most of you guys that follow the channel know I will be turning 59 in March. That means I'm one year and barely three months away from being 60. Yes, 60, it's hard for me to believe. But truly, and I'm proud to say, I do not have a 60 year old looking neck or face. Some of these yoga exercises I've been practicing since I learned them from my grandmother in my 20s. Oh, so many years ago. Yeah, like the 80s. So let's get started. You want to sit up straight. If you have long hair, you want to get that out of the way. Whenever you're doing any sort of skincare routine or you're doing these facial exercises, very simply, you sit up straight and relax. It's very important when you're doing these type of exercises to relax. We do not want to stretch the skin. Our goal is to stretch the muscles and work and tone the muscles underneath the skin. Big difference. As you can see here, using my fingertips, it doesn't take a lot of lift to actually move all of the entirety of your neck skin. A fourth of an inch movement will actually lift all of it. We want to sit upright, look straight forward, and we're going to be using our swallowing muscles or mechanism while we do this exercise and purse our lips out just a little, just to be able to feel these muscles right underneath the skin. And though I usually do this for a count of 10, we're gonna do it for a count of five today for the video and for those of you who are new. So are you ready? And relax. That's the basic move, but there's a little more to it than that. Now we're gonna do it to the left side. Then we're gonna do it to the right side for the same thing, count of five, count of five. Are you ready? All right, so you will feel the movement in these muscles to the right side when you do this to the left. Then we're gonna do it to the right side to work the left side muscles. Are you ready? And of course, we're gonna feel that over here on this side. So this facial exercise is a set of three movements. Now, you can do this up to five times. So that's that three set movement, five times, working your way up two to three times per week the first week, working to where you're doing it daily. I do it in the morning first thing. And you can work the timing count up to 10. Now, why this works so well is that as we get older, we lose collagen density in our skin, those muscles that we tend to use in the neck and the face get tired. We use them a lot. People that have had fillers and Botox along the jawline, also those muscles tend to shrink over time, making the skin a lot looser. And more good news, on top of it, as we get older, we tend to lose some of the bone density that's in our chin and our jaw, leading to the double chin, the loose jaw skin, and the saggy loose skin on the neck. This is a simple, non-invasive way that will help lift and tighten and tone all of that without Botox or fillers or any sort of surgery. Again, I will put a link to my entire yoga facial video down below in the video description box. For those of you who are new, please be sure and check that out. And for those of you who aren't new, you might want to go back and refresh yourselves with that video. If you found this video information helpful, please like it, share it out, comment in the comments below, and of course, subscribe if you haven't. Now for even more ways to roll back the clock on skin and body aging, be sure to check out this video that's coming up next. Thank you guys so much for supporting the channel and watching. I appreciate you. Stay beautiful. Again, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you over on that next video.